What did we hate about the first wedding? Everything. He split his pants open on our wedding day. What? I'm not, like, from crotch to butt. He's <laughs> ripped her the whole way. My name's Lyra Lee Sponberg, and I'm here at Kleinfeld's to look for a wedding dress. Welcome to Kleinfeld. Thank you. Come follow me. This is a second marriage for both of us. This is the bridal party. Oh, wow. There are two boys that are missing. Okay. That we didn't think would be so keen on being here with us. Okay. We sort of see this is our wedding together as the eight of us, as opposed to just two people. I'm here with two of my biological daughters and two daughters to be. They just moved into our house and. It's a little overwhelming at times, but I guess it's fun to have two little sisters. I think it'll be fun for them to be here with me and, and to have their opinion. How do you feel about beading, lace, embroidery? Girls? How do you feel about beading, lace, and embroidery? No beading. No what does beading. that mean? Do you like, yeah. do you like sparkle? Yes. You're asking the right girl. <laughs> <laughs> it's fun for me to see the girls all excited and their eyes wide open and all these beautiful dresses around. Lots of dresses yeah. everywhere, bright light. I saw lots of mirrors. <laughs> what type of dress do you have in mind? Uh, getting married on a beach, probably barefoot, so not anything with a train. So more uh, straight, streamline. Yeah. Uh, yeah, OK. You want to do a little shopping, girls? Yeah. 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 Come on, let's go. <laughs> Sometimes her sense of style is a little off. Anything you want to try. I love this okay? one. Try this oh. one. Look how beautiful that is. Yeah. I haven't really thought about a budget. It's, I think something is right is right. With no firm budget in mind, Keisha takes Lyerly's lead and pulls the bride's favorite dresses. The first dress I tried on was a unique, really beautiful dress. The girls thought it was a little too fussy. It's very romantic. Isn't it beautiful? I don't think it's flattering. You know what I love about it, though, is the layers. OK, so hands, how many like this one? Half of them. The second dress is a dress that I, what, four out of five liked, and it was very comfortable. It's not quite as simple as what I had in mind, but it's very feminine. I still don't like the flowers. I like the flowers. Like no. flowers. Keisha's style was a little different from what we were thinking, but in the end, she definitely realized what our vision was, I guess. This I love. This yes. Yeah. All in okay. favor, let's see the thumbs. Three thumbs, thumbs up. <laughs> Three thumbs up. She was trying to please everyone, you know, and I had to keep her focused. You know, this is your day, this is your day, this is your day. Mine. I definitely liked, I liked the mine. second I one liked the best. The second and in. the third. The dress that I wore the first time I got married is a dress that I wouldn't even look at twice today, and so it is exciting to have a, a second chance to do that. I actually, I knew you were going to like this one. Oh. Didn't I just say Amanda <laughs> yes. will like this one? But it would get really dirty They're in the holes. sand. Lyra's girls, they had a lot to say. And as a mother and soon-to-be stepmom, uh, she had a sensitive ear to each and every one of them. I, like I will try on a sparkly one. I'll nice try over the top just for you. Okay? Yes. The jury's still out, so Keisha pulls more dresses to please her girls. I want to make everyone happy with one dress. And Lyra's youngest wants to help with the dress selection, too. Tell me where it is. This is the one? OK, I'm going to get Daniela to go pull this off her. Let's see how your bride looks in it. All right, fine. All right, come on. <laughs> of course, beauty is in the eye of the beholder. This is for the same child that when I dressed up as a prostitute one year for Halloween, she told me how beautiful I looked. <laughs> yeah, I don't think it's me, honey. I should be in the bloopers. <laughs> You deserve That's having bad taste. Lyerly hadn't considered a budget, and now she has sticker shock. You want to look beautiful, but it's not the most important thing. And I think especially in our situation where we're our family's most important thing, and uh, the dress is, you know, I'll remember it, but I'm sure I'll remember the day more. I really like this one. Is it comfy? It looks beautiful on her. Yeah, it looks really good. This is sort of what I think I had in my head in some ways, but I like the romantic light quality of the other one. But once she found her dress, she got cold feet about the price. A little one. So at the end of the appointment, I realized uh, that uh, Lyle was struggling a little bit. She's like, the dress is out of my price point. I said, OK, <laughs> but that's not what you told me in the beginning of the appointment. I would be shocked if she comes back to purchase that dress. But we'll see. She loves the dress, and we'll see if she comes back. Lyerly didn't come back for her dress.
Becky. Hi. Hi. I'm Christiana. Nice Welcome to meet to you. Club. I'm Becky and I'm from Edmonton, Alberta, and I'm here to find the perfect dress. Who are you here with? This Hi. is my stepmom, Helen. Hi. Nice, nice to, to meet, meet you. you. This is my dad, Darwin. Hi, Hello. Dad. Nice to meet you. And this is my husband, Jordan. Hi. Hi. Congratulations. Thank you. All right, follow me. Come on in, have a seat right there. So you introduced him as your husband. We've been married once already. Okay. And it was really disappointing. So you had a wedding? Yeah, we had the full-blown, big, 100-person wedding. And you hated it? It was a huge disappointment. Everything that could go wrong went wrong, from the dress, the hair, the makeup, even the weather. It was just horrible. <laughs> My husband and I got married two years ago. We actually met on the internet. He's in the Canadian military. Jordan came home from Afghanistan okay. for 18 days. Okay. We got married and he left again. I, I had no idea what was even going on that day. We didn't have time to think about the wedding or be excited for the wedding. So it was like rushed. All right, yeah. so you want to do it again, you want to do it the right way. Right. Yeah. This time we're getting married on the island of Lanai in Hawaii. Very intimate, very small. I want it to be the dream wedding. These are just ideas? Yeah, I'm trying to stay open, but it's the general feel. Of you like a lot of beading? Yes. You like lace? Yeah. You like tool? Price-wise, where are you comfortable at? I'd like to stay between three and 5000 All right, I'm going to go um, pull a couple options just to start. Hoping to find Becky a second dress worth remembering, Christiana seeks out Randy. She hated her wedding dress. She hated her wedding. OK. Which is pretty strong words for yeah. a bride to say. This is one of the most important days of their lives. So everything should be perfect. So when I hear that a wedding didn't go right or that they hated their wedding, it kills me. If you're gonna do it, do it right. Hi. Hi, Hi beautiful. What did we hate about the first wedding? Everything. He split his pants open on our wedding day. What? I'm not, like, from crotch to butt. <laughs> Swift her the whole way. Really? Bad news. Christiana hopes dress number one will help Becky put the past behind her. Nice. Yeah, but I see, you know what happened the last time on the first time I bought a dress is I bought one that fit. It's nice, but, but we're not, not there the yet. Same. But I'd like to see Jordan's reaction. What do you think? I, I think you look elegant in this dress. It's flattering for her, it makes her look great. It, it makes me a lot more excited for her wedding. Well, how do you feel in it? I feel boring. This is similar to my first wedding dress. Okay. It felt very typical, very traditional. I want something very dramatic. It's just too plain and it's not my style. I would probably regret walking away with something safe when I, in my heart, I wanted something so different. I think we should keep going. We should, I'll start pulling things that are more your style. All right, let's do this. What do you think of this? This is tough. I like it, but I'm wondering if it's, do I like it today? And will I like it a year from now? What do you think? I, I think this looks good on you. I like it. Really? <laughs> I love this on her. She looks really good. More blingy. Like. I, I love this top part. It's it looks like, nicer than the first dress. It looks nice I like on you, this but better than the first. But I don't know if you like it. She's very picky, and the hardest part was telling her to be open. I'm worried that I like it now, and I'm worried in a year I'll be thinking like, what was I on? I think because Becky didn't like her first wedding dress, she's really afraid to pull the trigger on this second wedding dress. I always say go with your gut. Yeah. Whatever that tells you. It's just like when you meet the right guy. You just know it. I don't know. How about we come back to yeah, it? Yeah, I'm not ready to yeah, say that, 100%. Yeah, I think, I think you need to have this one sink in for a little bit. Unsure about dress two, Christiana puts Becky in one of the bride's requests. This was also in your list? No dice. No dice. No dice. This is one of my favorite lace dresses in the whole store. So don't poo-poo it right away. Well, it's a different fit, too. Oh, no. No dice. Just relax. I'm sorry, I know it has feelings, but no. <laughs> I know my standards are astronomical. Really? That was fast. Yeah, I, I, Damn it. I know how important that day is, and I know how important it is for me to get it right this time. I don't want her to walk away from the appointment saying, I wanted something different, and I didn't. I chickened out. I'm hoping I'd be confident enough to do the different style dress. 
I hope she doesn't get scared. Beautiful heart. Let's do this. Okay. It's very light. There's not so a lot light. to it. You look like a bride. Now, how do you feel in this dress? Not as good as the last one. Oh, OK. <laughs> I think that Becky needs to maybe take a step back, maybe don't overanalyze it too much. I'd put this one in third place. I like the last one much I better. I like the last one better. Can we see that last one one more time? Absolutely. Let's put that at last one on again. Christiana puts Becky back in dress too, hoping she'll listen to what her heart wants. I brought you something to think about. OK, perfect. No, I really like it. I like how I feel. <laughs> it's good. Yeah. Let's show them. This dress makes me feel beautiful. It makes me feel original. It just makes me feel amazing. What do you think? I love it. I could see myself in it, and I could see myself walking with my dad to Jordan. I feel beautiful, and I didn't feel that way the first time, so it's, it's really nice to feel that way this time. You really deserve to feel beautiful on your wedding day. Thank you. Is this your wedding dress? Yes. Are you saying yes to the dress? Yes, I am. Yay! Becky purchased this $5,700 Lazaro gown. It's exciting. I never felt this way. I never cried, and I'm so excited to do it for real. <laughs> Tracy and her husband are only six weeks away from her 20th anniversary vow renewal. This is probably the most important because this one is the, the last gown I'll ever wear for the rest of my life. After a tragic accident brought them back together, Debbie and Randy are hoping to make this second time bride's dreams come true. Tracy, you ready? And we're ready. Oh, hi, beautiful. So I hear that you're walking down the aisle for the third <laughs> time. Third time. With the same guy. Love the guy. That's pretty cool. Yeah. Look what we found. Mm. So I think what? I'm going to start with this one. OK. OK. <gasps> Look at that. Isn't that beautiful? I like this. How could you pick the first one? OK. So we're going to go on here. Yes, come on up and look in the mirror. First one I tried on. It is a beautiful gown. How do you feel in it? Pretty good, because it has okay. what I like. I mean, it has the length in the back, mm -hmm. the flowers I wanted. The lace-up is exactly what I wanted for the romantic era kind of thing I'm looking at. OK. OK, okay. give me how many thumbs up? Honest. Honest? It's a beautiful dress, but I can't see you in it. Yeah, there's something missing. Like what? You know me. It doesn't fit your personality. Mm -mm. I think this dress is too plain for my mom. I feel like she has more flair to her. It's too simple. It doesn't look like something you would wear. They're rolling their eyes. They're going, oh, you know, that's not the gown. And I'm thinking it's gorgeous, but it just was not me. Yep, we got a couple we have some more things in the room I think you're going to like. OK. OK, but let's try the feather one okay. on. When I put it on, I felt like, that's it, that's it. This is the number one right now. I just want to see the reaction. Oh. <laughs> oh. I love ostrich feathers. It may not be my classy side. It may be more couture. I like it, and I think this might be it. You love this? I love this. It's feathers on a dress. She looks like a seagull is going to try and pick her up on the boardwalk. Oh, I think this is it. No. I seriously think this is the one I want. You know how much I love little baby ostriches and... You look like a bird. I do not look like a you bird. You look like a bird. You'll look like a parrot. Oh, I think it would be so cool. Maybe if you're having, like, a circus-themed wedding. A circus-themed wedding? <laughs> so you don't want your mom to wear this dress? No. No. I want the kids to be a factor in making all decisions, so I may have to sacrifice what I want. And Chris, I need you to walk me down the aisle. Wait till you see what she's putting you in. <laughs> her family wants her in something different than what, than she, what she actually wants. She's willing to compromise wow. someone, but still, that becomes a problem. You know what it is? Because they have it in their head how they want to see her 
However, we don't have that many dresses to choose from. There is yeah. one dress that I did see, but we were searching before. We have this one dress, and I'm really hoping that she loves it because we're so limited to what we can show her because the wedding is in six weeks. Let's see. Oh, does it, is it gonna lace? And this is just totally in the direction I wouldn't have went. It's beautiful. Yeah. yeah. Wow. I can picture myself walking down to the beach. It looks like sea waves on the bottom of it. Because if the wind picks it up on the beach, it would yeah. be blowing. Do you want to show your family? Yes, please. OK. Yeah. It's, it's it. It's perfect. I think this dress is right on the money of what I wanted. It's perfect for her. Do you all feel that this might be the dress that Mom might walk down the island? It's not a might, it's a definite. So you're saying yes to the dress. <laughs> you're saying yes to the dress. You're yes. saying yes to the dress. Tracy, are you saying yes to I'm the dress? I'm saying yes to this yes. dress. Yes! Yeah. <laughs> Tracy will renew her vows in this $3,000 Alita Graham gown. It is a relief to have the perfect gown when it's on your body. <sighs> I'm in my gown. You know, that look like it, it was just the best feeling in the world.